What's up? I'm going to be trying to avoid some negative situations this um, year because I don't need more negativity in my life. And the very first one is politics. I think um, I need to just... <laughs> it speaks for itself. It's like a terrible conversation to have. It always gets personal and nasty and... I'm just going to avoid it because I was I found myself guilty recently on YouTube going around getting involved in the political process I'm like eh, eh. I need to stay away. I need to avoid eating some unhealthy food. Yes, I eat overall healthier, but I'm beginning to think there's a trend with certain foods that affect me greatly. And I think high sugar foods or gluten foods seem to have uh, really impacted my skin and stuff like that. I don't know what to, I think there's a correlation now because I have skin problems. You know, I'm not perfect. You know, I'm no, as you can tell, I'm not perfect. Look at this. <laughs> and uh, I get like, you know, you know, normal things like a lot of white people tend to get is peeling skin and a lot of eczema and all that dermo, whatever the hell all that skin is. I'm seeing a dermatologist, but. I think my diet is correlated to a lot of it. So if I can try to avoid this gluten-free and see if it has any positive effects and no, and keeping the dairy out of it, then we'll see. Um, so yeah. And number three, speaking of skin, I'm going to try to minimize my contact with the sun. I will be wearing sunscreen every time I go out. I have been, and I haven't been getting that much sun in the past two or three years. I used to get so much sun before that. I used to like, I used to be like always tan, but it takes damage on your skin the more you do it over the years. And finally, I need to avoid um, spending too much money. But I think I've been good at that this year um, uh, because I'm so broke. You know, I don't have that much money to buy anything I want. I have finally managed to start somehow, managed to start saving a little money. The tax refund I got back this year, it helped me a little bit. There's one thing. Um, and this is truly the last one, negative situations in general. If somebody comes to me about something negative, I shouldn't feed into it. I should somehow turn it into something positive, no matter how negative I agree with it. I had to turn something into something positive. That way it neutralizes the situation and I don't feel nasty. It's like, you know, when you eat a bunch of Cheez-Its or, you know, potato chips or something late at night and then go into bed, you probably feel, ugh, I feel gross. What did I do to myself? I pigged out. Well, that's the way I feel for negative situations. I feel like, look, I gorged myself. So, yeah, I got to turn that into something positive. So all these themes can be turned into something very positive. So it's not necessarily running away. It's sort of converting, I guess you could say. So what about you guys? What, what, I want to hear about you. Why don't you guys propose some, something, you know, as far as turning something into something positive? Go ahead. Spit it out. Okay, guys. All right, bye.